Well, what is going on, guys? Stop for the hair back with a video. So, guys, as you see in the entire guys, yes, we're gonna be talking about Call of Duty Ghost 2 and why I think they should come out with a Ghost 2 in the 2021 or 22. This is my opinion, this is not true, it may be true, who knows? But yeah, subscribe to the channel and let's get to the video. So now guys, if you have played Call of Duty Ghost Mission and you played it when it came out in 2013, you would have seen this part of the mission. Basically, we have this part right here guys where you're at the last part of the mission and you're on the sand with your teammate. He says you're proud of your Logan, the last new couple of nukes go off in the ocean and you're just laying there, okay? And after a couple of seconds, you'll come to this cutscene right here. Toward the end, where you expect the ending of Call of Duty Ghost to happen at, of it saying Call of Duty Ghost, the emotion missions have right there, developed by Raven Software, Infinity War, Activision, all that. And once you get through that, it goes back to the sand beach, and then you see this happen. As you see right there guys, Warren basically tells you that there's going to be no more ghosts, that you're going to be part of the Federation, and that you're going to destroy the ghosts with him. And they start just dragging you away. And your teammate starts calling out for your name, and then that's where the, that's where the mission ends right there. Now guys, if you, once the mission ends right there and he pulls you away, you're going to have the credits. And if y'all wait and watch the whole entire credits, which is about like 5-6 minutes long, all at the end of the credits, you will see this. And as you see right there guys, Logan's basically in like a little sewer tank or like sewer pipe thing in the ground. And you can see the forest or like a bunch of trees and it starts raining and he's trapped in there. And once that ends, basically that's the end of the mission and you get back to the home screen where the campaign and stuff's at. And that's where it basically ends guys. And my opinion of what I would think happened to Logan is that Rourke put him on a drug put him inside the little sewer tank or whatever it's called kept him there and when logan woke up he basically lost his memory of becoming a ghost and now he's part of the federation team now is that theory through or my opinion through probably not who knows that's just my opinion of what i think happened tell me y'all tell me y'all's opinion in the comments down below i'm kind of curious but yeah that's what i basically think what happened and then that's where it ends right there and i think they should come out with a I think Affinity War should come out with a Call of Duty Ghost 2 that leaves off from right there. So it leaves off what happens to Logan. If does he get saved or does he part is he part of the Federation as he start killing ghosts? Like what happens? I'm kinda curious. I don't know. Hope they do make a Call of Duty Ghost 2. If they don't, that's oh well, because this game did come out seven years ago or eight years ago. And it's been eight years since it came out with a Call of Duty Ghost since they came out with a new Call of Duty Ghost game. So who knows? Hopefully they do come out with a Call of Duty Ghost 2 guys, but if you are if you're on the channel, subscribe down below and also tell me guys if y'all want to see Call of Duty Ghost 2 in the future. But yeah, anyways, it's your boy Snowman. I'm out guys. Peace.